Now, the testing coming back from what Peyton, how he's running the system, is still good. So your water is, is really good. Is there, a break, is there a breakdown of what that water utility is making right now? And is it financially stable? That's I mean, a budget question. I don't have the numbers, but it's been losing a lot of money. I know that, Brad. In this last year? Uh, I don't do you know the current numbers. The water numbers? utility does not lose money. The sewer. Right. The sewer, sewer utility. utility. Okay. The water is yeah. definitely offset, but the, the sewer is always it. The sewer, as we know, why every month I was coming and saying that. That, that, that has not changed. The sewer is running over red. It takes away. Yeah. Yeah. And that's why our next hot ticket is to get the sewer treatment plan. I'd just like to point out that. Uh, we've agreed that we have a safe and effective water utility that's operating at a profit that this board has elected to acquire a $1.2 million, $1 million loan that's got to be paid back off, uh, increase in expenses, and if you look at the, the statistics and the, the figures as carefully as I have, you'll you realize that in almost every situation, the number that they could find to be an extreme case that would help their position was used. So either there was a deception by the board of telling the engineering firm that we don't want alternative one, as it's called in the perform uh, preliminary engineering report. We, we need to get away from Wausau, so let's use every reason we can use to get away from them, or it was the engineers are deceiving you by using incorrect numbers so that you believe that this is necessary. But either either way, there's been a deception perpetrated, and I'd like to have a meeting where we could talk about this with our neighbors and get to the bottom of it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.